Dear students of class 6th from Girls Government Upper Primary School, Batagun Zoon Mawar. Today on dated 5th of August 2020, the day Wednesday. Our subject maths and topic subtraction of integers. Dear guys, yesterday we learned that we are, we are going to subtract two integers. The integer which is to be subtracted is we add it is additive inverse to the integer from which it is subtracted. Dear guys, it is our exercise number 6.3, question number 1, part 1, 35 minus 20. It is 35 solution, 35 minus 20, that is 35 plus, we add the, when we are subtracting two integers, we add adverse, add it to inverse of this integer to the first integer that is 35 plus we it is added it is added to inverse that is minus 20 when the one integer is having positive sign and another is having negative sign they are not added but they are subtracted from each other when we subtract 35 from um, 20 from 35 5 1 is when reduced by 0, there, there remains 5, and 3 tens when reduced by 2 tens, then there remains 1 ten, that is 1 5 15. There, guys, the part B, you can, I hope you can now solve it yourself. Bill, part C, confusion Here it is part C, minus 15, minus minus 18 we have to subtract minus uh, 18 from minus 15 here it is our question minus 15 minus minus 18 when we are going to subtract two integers we add add the add, adjective inverse of the this integer that means minus 15 is added by plus 18 the now the two integers one having negative sign one having positive sign they are not added to each other but they are subtracted from each other that means when 18 reduced by 15 they remain as 3 the 3 are of plus 18 so this it is here plus 3 now there is part D dear guys it is minus 20 minus 13 here solution minus 20 minus 13 it is our question that implies minus 20 we have to add it is added to inverse that is we have to add plus minus 13 but here the both integers are of negative sign having negative sign so they are added to each other with the uh, the sign will remain the same when 20 is added by 13 it will become 33 but with a negative sign that is minus 33 then question number two guys fill in the blanks with greater smaller or equal t sign if the two there are two integers we have to say whether this the integer on the left side is greater than the integer on the right side or smaller or they are equal here question number a it is minus three plus minus six it is our left hand side then the right hand side is minus three minus minus six we have to say whether this portion is greater than that portion or not or they are or it is smaller or equal to that portion it implies this when we take the left hand side it is minus three dear guys you should know that when the two signs are multiplied together if we add we multiply minus by minus it will become plus if we uh, multiply minus by plus it will become minus when we multiply plus by plus it will become plus you should remember that when the two same signs either two negative signs or two positive signs are multiplied with each other the net result is positive plus sign and when one of the signs is negative and one of them is positive then the net result will be negative sign you should you remember this within your mind and now we can solve this question 
here it is minus 3 then there are here two signs with a bracket means um, multiplication in between them we have learned here that when the plus is multiplied with minus the two signs are of different type then the net sign will be negative therefore it will be minus 3 minus 6 it will be when the two different signs are multiplied the net sign is minus here it will be minus 3 minus 6 when the two integers are of same having same sign they are added to each other and with the net sign will be this both of them will be same that is 3 plus 6 is equal to 9 but the sign is negative it will be minus 9 we have learned this on the number line also that when we have to follow this we will go first three steps towards the left of the zero then when reach to the minus three then starting from the minus three we will go um, six steps again towards the left having minus six we will go six steps again towards the left and we will reach to the minus nine and now here the question is minus three minus minus six that is minus three the when the two signs of same type two signs of same type are multiplied each other the net sign will be po positive that is plus here it is minus three plus six but the two integers one is negative integer and one is positive integer they are not added together they are subtracted from each other when we uh, reduce six by three there will be three but this three will be out of this plus six so it will be plus three now the mm, this left hand side is equal to minus nine and the right hand side is equal to three but we know that always a sign which on the number line is on the right side is greater to the uh, integer which is on the left side if a um, if we draw a number line and show these two integers on the number line the three will be on the right side and minus nine will be on the left side so this three is uh, greater than minus nine or we can say minus nine is smaller than three so we can put here a smaller sign then there is part b also here it is minus 21 minus minus 10 on the left hand side the right hand side is minus 31 plus minus 11 here when we solve this left hand side first it is minus 21 the two signs multiply these the signs are of same type so the net sign will be plus it will become plus 10 now the one integer is negative and one is positive they are subtracted from each other when the 21 is reduced by 10 there will remain 11 but these 11 are out of this 21 so they are be minus 11 the right hand side is minus 31 mm, two signs of opposite type is multiplied the net sign is minus here we are, i have already told you when the two sides are of um, different types the net result is negative sign so it is minus 31 it will become minus 11 both the integers are minus they are negative integers so they are added together and when these we add these two together one one is and one one is they become two ones that three tens and one tens they will become four tens that is net will be 42 but both are negative so there will be minus 42 now here it is minus 11 and here it is minus 42 dear guys you know that when we draw a number line and we start from the zero first of all we will reach to the minus 11 minus one minus two minus three minus here will be somewhere here will be minus 11 and to go 42 we have to go further towards the left hand that means 42 will be towards the left of the 11 11 will be the uh, minus 11 will be the right of minus 42 on the number line and number which is on the right side of the another number on the number line is greater so minus 11 is greater than 42 dear guys here is part c hope that you can now um, do this for yourself if any problem you can contact me now there is part d i will show you here it is minus 25 minus minus 42 here it is minus 42 minus 
mm, minus 25 both the integers 14 are same here minus 25 here it is minus 25 it is minus 42 here, here it is also minus 42 and but the positions of the integers is different here 25 is in front minus 25 is in front and here minus 25 is on the back side when we will solve this first taking the left hand side that is minus 25 the two signs are same so net sign will be positive 42 the um, one of the integer is negative and one is positive so they are subtracted when we subtract 42 by 25 the net will be 17 plus 17 these are out of this 42 now solving the right hand side it is minus 42 minus minus 25 it will be minus 42 and the two signs are um, same so the net sign will be positive 25 but the two integers are again of different having different signs when they are subtracted from each other and they, there will remain 42 there will remain 17 but these 17 are out of these minus 42 so they are minus 17 now dear guys we know that the 17 is on the right side and minus 17 is on the left side of a uh, number line the number which is on the right side is greater than the number which is on the left side so we can say 17 is greater than the minus 17 dear guys hoping you have followed me and question number three and four we will um, will be done inshallah tomorrow uh, this is these are your questions you can put them on your notebook and try them yourself inshallah tomorrow tomorrow we will meet again assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh